Hey guys, it's Kristen with IcyStarsQuilting.com. Got my cute little pin on today. I have had a really, really good week. So for those of you who don't know, at the time of this video, it is Quilt Festival in Houston this week. Look at how beautiful this convention center is. So this is actually, I'm very lucky. This is right in my backyard, right in my hometown. This is a few sneak peeks. They won't let you in the room, but a few sneak peeks from one of the windows upstairs looking down on the actual quilts that are in the show. I can't wait to show you some more pictures of that. Please know that I'm gonna be showing more pictures from the quilt show. As it's happening, I'm taking tons of pictures. I actually got a media pass this year, which is really exciting. I'm gonna show you all the fun stuff that I got from the quilt show. My, my haul, my fabric, my stash, all of that stuff. And then I'm gonna show you my favorite quilts. Just how incredible this show is as well. Like it's, it's so amazing. I'm so excited and I cannot wait to share more with you. But for today, I have a fun piece of mail that came to me today. This is from Creative Notions. I love, love, love these box. Okay, so I get really excited when this comes to my door. So forgive my like spitting out of words and things. But so I've, I've already cut the tape. I haven't seen what's inside it yet. We'll see it together. And I mean, already this is like a bigger, whoa. This is a bigger box than it normally is. So it's very cute and pretty. And let me show you, look at, this is not working. There we go. Look at how fun this is. Isn't that beautiful? Okay, so they have a cute little Halloween lollipop there. We have some fun fabric. I'm trying to get down to the spot where it shows like this piece right here, which is what we actually have in here. So the box value is at $91 this month. This is a really packed full box. So we get six fat quarters and half yard. We get a nine and a half inch square up ruler, which if you've been following this year, they sent out one ruler every single month. So by the end of the year, you have an entire stash of rulers I like to call them even up rulers, but right, so like you can even up all of your blocks to be square and perfectly square. So you're getting one of those rulers every single month this year. Um, there's elastic, there's cording, there's thread and needles. There is a block of the month. Um, and there is three yards of cotton rickrack. There's a sewing machine cover and ironing station pattern. That sounds exciting. There is a subscriber block of the month. And then there is the insole bright at half a yard. So, wow. Okay, so let's dive in. Let me show you the products that are in here. So here's your elastic, just nice 70% polyester, 30% spandex elastic. I don't know what it's all for, but good thing with these boxes is everything that's in this box is going to go with the patterns that you have. You're gonna have everything to make these patterns. You don't have to like go and get a ton of extra stuff. They don't just give you patterns for the heck of giving you patterns, right? They give you patterns that will follow you as you work with these products, okay? So you don't have a ton of stuff. Oh, okay. For those of you who can see right behind me, I get a lot of questions about this sewing machine cover, okay? Here is a tip. I'm gonna put the link down below that shows you how I made this sewing machine cover, but there's no pattern for it. I kind of made it up as I went because I was on a very creative streak that day and I knew I needed a sewing machine cover and so I just made it and I love it. And it's very cute and it's very colorful in the background, right? But here is another sewing machine cover. Isn't that cute? It's got a quilt block on it. And then they also have an ironing station cover right there. Actually, if you believe it, I have that piece of furniture right there. That's from Ikea. I have that in my kitchen. <laughs> so you have the instructions for how to make that as well as, you know, all of the, the cording and the elastic and everything that you're going to need to make those. We've got a nice roll of cotton thread here. It's kind of a white color. So we've got some needles here as well as a bonus decorative magnet. That'll go really, really cute on my, uh, my metal cabinet back there. That's a fun, happy, floral, free spirit magnet. Um, we also got, I know I say this every time, but this box is 
full of patterns. It's full of patterns. Can you see that? Look how beautiful that table runner is. Now they give you the ideas for it and they show you how to make it. There's instructions on the back for how to make this table runner, which also goes with the block of the month is right here. Look at those different variations using that same pattern. Just switching up the pieces, changing it up a bit. That's pretty cool. So here's the Rick Rack that she talked about in the, in the newsletter, as well as another um, block of the month. This one is Carolina Lilies. Can you see how pretty that is? It's a little bit shiny with the, the light, but can you see how pretty that block of the month is with the lilies? Here is one more block of the month. Again, it shows step by step how to make each of these blocks. You are never left on your own. Okay, we've got a couple more things down in here. Um, we get the Insulbrite, which is going to be for your ironing board cover, right? You're gonna need something that is going to absorb the heat so that you don't ruin any tabletop surfaces. And that Insulbrite is what is going to absorb the heat. And here is, the nine and a half inch square up ruler. I can show it to you like that. These rulers are really, really nice. They're beautiful with the printing and the color and they have a little bit of a non-slip on the back so that it stays put when you're actually cutting your fabric, which is really, really nice. I've loved using these rulers. I cannot say enough good things about them. Now, last thing is let me show you this fabric because it's stinking adorable. Okay, hold on, let me show you this fabric. Let me get up close where you can see this really, really good. Look at this. So this looks like thread, right? And then you go into the next one and it's like button flowers, spools of thread, more stitching, quilting looking. This one has sewing and words written all over it that are really pretty. More fabric, crisscross fabric. And then the last one is the half yard one. And that just has sewing items like all over it. This bundle is precious. Now let me show you again. Isn't that gorgeous? So they're taking one of their like blocks right there. This is the, the front the back, and then the ironing cover. This is so pretty. So I hope that you enjoyed that sneak peek into this month's box. I'm gonna put the links down below if you would like to subscribe to the Creative Notions Quilting Box. This is one that I highly recommend. It's very thoughtful, it's very curated. I don't feel like I get any um, extra junk you know, like as a quilter, I have plenty of extra junk. I don't need more. So, um, you know, just little like uh, little kitschy stuff. I don't really need all of that stuff. I use the stuff that's in this box every single month. So for more modern quilting tips, tricks, and tutorials, I'm your girl. I'm Kristen with IcyStarsQuilting.com. Make sure you hit the subscribe button down below so that you don't miss out on any of the videos that I'm posting. I cannot wait to tell you more about the quilt show that's happening right now. Oh, so many beautiful things to explore, so many new things to learn, and so many wonderful people to meet. If you see me at the quilt show, make sure that you come say hi. Just tap me on the shoulder. Say hey. I hope that you have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye! Thank you.